How We Think by John Dewey, written in 1910. This is not a review of the book, neither is a summary. Rather, we are just talking about this book. It's a great book for a minute or two. And uh, this book is about thinking, which uh, all of us take for granted. And uh, no one can teach you to, to think. It's like just like breathing. But there's a difference between thinking and thinking well. More of uh, our waking life than we should uh, care to admit, even to ourselves, is uh, likely to be wild away in this inconsequential trifling with the idle fancy and unsubstantial hope. So, uh, considering this, the principal subject of this book is reflective thought, the defining quality of the fruitful and creative mind. Reflection involves not simply a sequence of ideas, but a consequence. Dee argues that it's not enough to simply have beliefs, but that we must also do the work required to examine them to understand why we hold them and to assess the consequences of holding such beliefs. Better thinking doesn't end. The more knowledge you cultivate, the better you will become at thinking about it. So start your journey towards reflective thinking. You can go ahead and find out about this book and read. And preparation is getting sense of a problem and we have to admit that our way of thinking can be problematic.